talking about footwork, footwork, footwork. Okay, uh, footwork. Uh, so I'm gonna talk about a couple different ways to throw your shots um, using your feet. Um, use whichever one works best for you. There aren't any that are better than others. Uh, they are all effective in their own way. Um, the first one I'm gonna talk about is what I call the lunge. And I think everyone needs to use the lunge in, less, in at least some of their shots, okay? There's always gonna be a shot where the person is a little bit further out of range than where you're standing and you need to lunge forward. So lunge is very basic. Step forward, step back out. Step forward, step back out, okay? I can do a little bit faster. That's the lunge. Um, next is what I call the split foot. So a split foot is when you're going to take the right foot and move it forward. The back foot is going to move back. And you might do that on your axis and the entire body might actually shift forward a little bit or shift backwards. But what it looks like is this. What the split foot does is by splitting the feet, it causes your body to rotate faster into the shot. And again, you can do it from a little bit further away and just move your body forward as you do the split foot. Next one I want to talk about is uh, either called the kicker or the slap shot. It follows the same principles as a slap shot in hockey. When you come through, the back foot actually comes forward. Okay, or the same thing in bowling, I bowl right-handed. The back foot comes forward. It helps bring your momentum forward, helps balance your body. I find I can feel a harder shot if I bring my back foot forward. So it looks like this. Um, I find it throws you a little bit off balance, but you can get a little more power out of the shot. Uh, the next one I want to talk about, I call the kickback, and this is actually the one I probably use most commonly along with the lunge. And the concept of this one is if the foot kicks backwards, that pushes the torso forwards. So the foot moving backwards pushes the torso forward, puts a little more weight in your shot, also extends your body forward. And it looks like this. And the last one I talk about, I call sort of a slide, which is you're going to take a position. This kind of works a little bit uh, like the lunge. And instead of stepping forward, you're sort of sliding into your shot. It's very similar. But you're sort of sliding in your shot, and at the end of the shot, you're just dropping the tip right onto the person. Okay, very similar to the lunge, it's just it's a sort of a different way of thinking.